Ramocitron reduces symptoms of irritable bowel syndrome and improves quality of life in women. Irritable bowel syndrome is a common disorder of the gastrointestinal system. It is classified into four types, such as irritable bowel syndrome with diarrhea, irritable bowel syndrome with constipation, mixed type irritable bowel syndrome, and unsubtyped irritable bowel syndrome. Many agents like 5-hydroxytryptamine receptor, 3 antagonists, were developed for treating irritable bowel syndrome diarrhea. Alostron has been approved for the treatment of irritable bowel disease only in women, and Ramocitron has been approved for the treatment in men. This study was a randomized, placebo-controlled phase 3 trial to determine whether Ramocitron reduces symptoms of irritable bowel syndrome with diarrhea in women. The primary objective of the study was to determine whether Ramocitron reduces the symptoms of diarrhea in irritable bowel syndrome in women and improves the quality of life. The study design was based on the previous studies. This randomized, double blind, placebo controlled clinical study comprised a provisional registration period, a one week baseline period, and a 12 week treatment period. The study protocol was designed in accordance with the Declaration of Helsinki City and was approved by the Institutional Review Board at all sites. A total of 580 patients were selected for the study. Chi square with a two sided significance level of 0.005 was used for the statistical analysis. Bristol stool form scale change in stool frequency was evaluated using the t-test. To compare the ramocitron group with the placebo group, analysis of covariance was performed with the treatment. Adverse events were evaluated using the Fisher exact test. Female patients of age 20 to 64 years, and diagnosed with irritable bowel syndrome with diarrhea, were included in the study. Female patients with colon, carcinoid, and medullary thyroid cancers, bowel obstructions, intestinal malrotation, ovarian cancer, were excluded from the study. The study comprised of a week baseline period and a 12 week treatment period. After the baseline period, eligible patients were assigned randomly to 12 weeks of oral treatment with placebo and ramocitron hydrochloride before breakfast. The visits were scheduled for at weeks 2, 4, 8, and 12 to assess the treatment efficacy, occurrence of adverse events, and drug compliance. Statistical analysis plans were finalized, and all data had been locked. The patients who were treated with ramocitron showed significantly higher rates for global improvement of overall irritable bowel syndrome symptoms at the last evaluation point than the placebo-treated patients. The patients who were treated with ramocitron showed significant improvement in the stool consistency than the placebo-treated patients. The monthly responder rate for abdominal pain or discomfort was significantly higher in ramocitron group than that in the placebo group. The monthly responder rate for abdominal bowel habits was significantly higher in ramocitron group than that in the placebo group. The responder rate for the abdominal pain, discomfort intensity, stool consistency was significantly higher in ramocitron group than that in the placebo group. The study proved that ramocitron was effective in treating female patients with irritable bowel syndrome with diarrhea and also improves the quality of life. This 5-hydroxytryptamine receptor 3 antagonist was likely to be beneficial not only for men but also for women.
Based on this study and previous study, ramocitron can be used for treating patients with irritable bowel syndrome diarrhea, regardless to sex.